silly mommy for life silly mommy for life let's get silly okay so i prop y'all up i like this handle i'm going to be buying me a tripod soon so i'm so happy um the hubby is buying it for me he's buying me a lot of stuff to work on my channel i'm so happy so glad my hubby is doing that for me um i saw the tripod that i wanted i'm uh bella just spoke up i'm getting him some serious almost time um to give the girls up from school Baby John had poop on him, okay? I just filmed a really quick video on how I give my kids, well, especially the little ones, three and under, um, medicine, and how, what flavor I add to enhance the better flavor than the nasty flavor. Go check that video out, y'all. I got a lot of videos coming, y'all. But, um, yeah, so, uh, I have not order it yet but it's on in the cart all i have to do is just place the order and i'll probably do that later on tonight i really don't have time anymore my time right now is about to get hectic and because the kids come i know you guys don't see me filming in the house when the kids do come home it's just so much that goes on hold up y'all it's just so much that goes on and get when the older kids, if I have to feed them, do homework with them, um, play with them, and study. Uh, Kayla, she's about to have her star test in April. So it's just a lot after 3 o'clock. And it's, that's not a good time for me to film. That's why I feel more when the older kids are at school. It's just easier for me. So what I'm giving Layla is honey bunches of oats. I'm not being sponsored, but if they want to sponsor me, go ahead. Come at your girl and sponsor her. So this... And I'm watching Birdie Gator. That's her channel. Let me see what's her channel name. Okay. Yeah. Bonnie Birdie uh, Gator. This is her channel. Yep. Um, she's real nice. She responds real quickly. And she do a lot of shop with me hauls. Shop with me hauls. Shop with me hauls. And just shop with me period. And just... If you subscribe to her channel, she don't know I'm giving her a shout out, but I'm giving you a shout out. Let her know that Silly Mommy for Life sent you, and just let her know. I love her channel. I love her channel. She be she telling us where the deals are at. Like she is the channel to go if you want to know your deals. Um. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to get her, her, um, her juice and her, her cereal, and then y'all won't see me in probably until I'm outside. And baby John got poop on him, so I really do need to get that down. But I'm about to turn her back up. Yeah. They're all pink. So today I am making and feeding the herd, the troop. <laughs> Who's the herd, the troop? It's my family. I am within the family of six and even more. Because between my mom, living with my mom, my dad, and my older sister, we're a big family. So, I am going to be making um, breakfast, going to make some pancakes, and <clears throat> some sausages. So, this is Johnsville Original Recipe Breakfast Sausage. It tastes so good. I love it. If you watch my daily vlogs, you hear my son in the background playing with his cars. <laughs> yeah, so if you watch my daily vlogs or any of my cleaning motivation videos, you would know that we love sausages and we love bacon. But today I am making sausages and this is a pack. I don't know how many come in here. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, wait, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, I believe. Fourteen to sixteen um sausages. And my family we would eat the whole thing. I normally eat I normally make two of these. But we only have one, so I'm making one. So I'm going to be showing you guys the process of me making breakfast. And what we eat on a breakfast morning when the hubby doesn't have to work the morning shift. So to uh, grease up the pan for my sausages, I am going to be using Pam Original uh, Conolo Blended. And the only thing is I got this, and I spray this around so the sausages don't stick. We had to skip it for the longest, y'all. <clears throat> and then I'm going to add a little bit of water to this. So, it's not that much water I added to it. Sit you guys back down. And sometimes it really depends on what, how I want my sausages. If I want them a little bit 
um, scorch. I would not add the water and I would just let it sizzle. And I'm just breaking down the sausages. Sometimes they're hard to break if they're like super frozen. the fire well not the fire but to start the stove up on I put it on the high 10 and as they start cooking I am going to uh, lower the temperature so I am going to be making uh, pancakes from the box and I love this this is Aunt Jemima buttermilk pancake and waffle mix uh, only thing you have to do is just add water I do not get that with eggs it's just way too much to deal with and to, for me for my family it's just a waste of eggs if I wanted eggs I w we will make eggs on the side um, but today we do not have any eggs so we're not eating eggs it's just going to be the sausage and um, the pancakes using a second skillet for um, the pancakes and I like to using it when I'm making pancakes for the troop, I like to, um, well, for the sillies, I like to uh, <coughs> use the bigger pan. And then I'm just going to be spraying all the way through so my pancakes do not stick at all. <clears throat> I'm also going to be using Crisco oil. Even though I just sprayed it, I just wanted to make sure the... This pan supposed to be not non-stick, but it does. So, so I'm just gonna like this. gonna be turning this on medium, and then as as the pot the pot as the pan start getting the heat up and the pancake start you know rolling on and I get more on I am going to be putting it in on four or either um on three so the pancakes don't burn as you see as I'm talking the um sausages is already getting um sizzled already starting to smell good you see it's how it's not sticking to the pan so it's a nice consistency no lumps or anything yes guys I have um vlogging <laughs> and watching um vloggers as well I'm trying to catch up on people vlogs so that's it and I'll start pouring so the only thing I'm doing is using my finger and just putting the access. I will be using this spoon later on to get all the pancake mix out when everything is done. When there's like that little bit and you just want to scrape it all off. And then I am going to clean, uh oh, I am going to clean the spoon. No, no. If you tired, go lay with daddy. He's like laying on the floor. See, nice and clean. And I'm just eyeballing y'all. I'm making large pancakes because um, <clears throat> even if somebody don't want a large pancake, I could cut it in half. And that will save me time keep making more pancakes. Just Make large amounts, big amounts, and just cut it in half um, if they don't want a big pancake. So I'm just grabbing a pan. I keep saying pan, y'all. Grabbing a plate and just putting it over so there's no flies or dust or debris. Don't go in here. And I'm just waiting for the sausages. So that's a nice little round pancake, kind of not so in a perfect circle, but that's fine. I do not try to make it in a perfect circle. And what you want to do is when the top start getting um, kind of hard, not hard, but 
um, firm, that's when you know when to flip it over. See, it's still watery, so I would not flip it over. If you flip it over right now, it will get all sticky and your pancake will fall apart. So I'm showing you real time as it go, and I don't have to show you after this one. So I am going to speed the video up. start bubbling up and getting firm on top it's almost to the time that it needs to be flipped now I am gonna have to prop you guys because I cannot flip the pancake and um, film at the same time let you guys get a look a, a, a closer look you see how like right there it's firm that's what you want and it's time to flip so let's flip the pancake okay like I said when I get my tripod it will be you guys will see more better. You see, I'm showing you guys the bottom. It's perfect, y'all. It's a good pancake. It's so good. I don't think we got enough butter. Oh, gosh. See how that is? Y'all. Mm. Oh, I was about to trip, y'all. I didn't think we had any more brother. My mom and my sister are di diabetic, so this is a good butter. Um, smart balance for a diabetic. Di people who have diabetes, they use this in the resident home. When I used to work at the resident home, this is what they served for, the, for them for an option. And they have this also in the hospitals. I was so happy. I'm going to let this sit out for a little bit because it's hard. And I like my butter soft. So what I'm using is a container. I have a bigger container, but all the containers are being used. So <clears throat> this container already had pizza. We um, made pizza the other night. And I'm just going to probably put this to the side. Somebody's going to have some tasty pancakes that tastes like, tastes like a pizza a little bit. But that's okay because I don't, I don't have a, a um, thing. So I'm going to take it off. You see, that was not that long. And look how perfect that pancake is, y'all. Look, oh, wonderful. Okay, so the rest of this video is going to be speed through a time lapse because I just showed you guys the way I made my pancakes. Um, super good, y'all, super good. So, I might, I don't know if I want to keep continuing to go. There you go. So, the sausages are ready too. I'm going to add the sausages um, to this. I'm going to spray this again, and usually I'll keep spraying. I actually want to probably add oil. You just want to make sure your pan stay greased up because oiled up because you don't want your pancakes to stick. The sausages are ready. I'm going to do another batch. So, the rest of this video is going to be uh, time lapse, so this video don't be too lengthy, but I did show you guys the process of me making a pancake in real life time. So let's speed this up, y'all. Let's get it. Let's get silly up in here. So as 
I like I said, I did the first pancake, and you see the second one is already cooking, and it's easier because now the pan is hot. Now the pancakes are starting to roll. What I usually do, um, the pan that I took the skillets out, I'm going to use that to also to make more pancakes. So now I have two pans to use with pancakes. Yes, I'm going to buy me a griddle, y'all. I am. I am. I'm getting my life because it'll be easier. I can make like 12 pancakes in one, six pancakes in one, and get my life. Get my life, y'all. So as those are cooking, I have a little bit of dishes um, in the sink. So I'm going to head and wash those up because I would like to have those dishes washed up before um, it's time for the skillet. So that's what I'm doing. See, I was taking pictures, so that's why I didn't say anything. As y'all see, I made a whole bunch for the troop. I'm going to start plating them, but I want to wash the dishes. Finish washing the dishes that I just used. Everything is done. I did this less than 35 minutes. That's how I do it around here. Get them in, get them out. Get them in and get them out. That was my mom motto. She had five kids. I don't have to wash any other dishes that I just got through washing a whole bunch of dishes. I am going to be using paper plates for my kids, sure enough. I also like to be used to use, um, yeah, paper plates, y'all. Let's save the house. You got Brittany. That's my hand. Michaela. Myself and baby John. Um, you have my sister and then the hubby. He's going to eat right before he goes to work. And that's about it. So. And I'm putting them back in here. So no dust and debris on there. That is Brittany. Brittany, say hi. Hi. Oh, hey, well, hey. Hey, silly. Okay. So. That needs to be warmed up. By the time I did all of this stuff, uh, mm -hmm. they got kind of cool. So, I'm just putting on 25 seconds. How many fingers am I holding up, guys? 
I have to use the bathroom. I oh, know. WTML. Y'all probably don't know, but if y'all know, put it in there. I'm going to... to close out this vlog don't forget to like comment and subscribe and silly up the notification bell that was our more that was our late afternoon breakfast routine for a large family of six and more if you like these type of videos please comment down below only thing i'm going to be doing after this is taking a bath because i look some type of way i look raggedy to the taggedies but that's okay i'm about to take a bath Get myself all uh, looking nice. Um, get everybody baths done together and before the hubby has to go to work at 4. So, and make sure all that's together. Thumbs up this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Silly up the notification bell. And I'll see you on the next vlog. Thank you for uh, tuning in. Bye. Stay silly.